Um, okay, so we have this terrific story to share with you of a young student athlete in our area. Brooke is here with his story. It is so great. He is so great. Aroxia Junior is a senior on the Crescenta Valley basketball team. And while you may not always see him on the court, he has still had a major impact on this team. At first glance, you may not even notice anything different about one of the players on the Crescenta Valley High School basketball team. And while you may not always see him on the court, Junie Rowe has had a big impact on this team. If everybody in the world approached life like Junie, I think it'd be a lot more pleasant place. Junie was born with cerebral palsy, a rare disorder that affects a person's ability to move, maintain balance, and posture. It can be severe in many cases, but Junie knows he's one of the lucky ones. So for me, I, I was pretty lucky to be able to walk and talk. Because people with cerebral policy, they, like, they can't talk, you know, usually like in a wheelchair, so we're pretty lucky. Despite being born with a disability, Junie knew early on that he wanted to be on the basketball court. He practiced, worked hard, played in local YMCA leagues. Then his parents suggested he try out for his freshman basketball team. And while Junie struggles in some areas physically, the coaches saw something special. I'm afraid. Um, he he gives everything that I've seen his best shot, and he stays even keel regardless of results. The team brought Junie on as a manager, putting him in charge of keeping scores, tracking equipment, and helping out with the team. And even though it wasn't the outcome Junie wanted, he put his heart into it, making sure he was the best manager he could be. When he's on the floor, he's going. When he's not, he's cheering. When he's managing, he's doing a great job at that. So. Um, that's what you get with him. But Junie didn't give up his dream of getting onto the court. He participated in practices and worked through drills. Even though he wasn't as physically strong as his teammates, he was willing to put in the work, and it paid off. We were got up pretty good and uh, put Junie in the game against uh, one of our league teams. The boys were fired up about it, and uh, Junie came out, missed his first three, Put the ball on the ground, made a little floater in the key. The boys went nuts, and then he stepped out and made a three. It was just so good to see a kid um, achieve that. Junie is back this year for his senior year, and whether he's on the court or off it, anyone on this team will tell you that he's an indispensable part. I think the guys know that he's just, if he's on the floor, He's going to give you what he's got as a teammate, and you can't ask for anything. You can't ask for anything more than that. For Junie, the feeling is mutual. I think this team helped me through a lot. I mean, the head coaches, to the coaches, to my teammates, helped me through a lot. I mean, they they help me get better each and every day. As for Junie's message to others who may be facing their own struggles, and I'll say, just keep trying, never give, never, never give up. I mean, I I practice every single day. I'm not sure it's day, so I'll just, just keep trying to never give up. No, I bet. You know, Aroxy, it's not all about basketball. Junie has actually been taking classes, summer classes, all through high school. He wanted to make sure that he graduates on time and can attend a four-year university. He is hoping that university is USC. He says it's been his dream his whole life. Well, obviously, when he puts his mind to something, he achieves it. I think what's great about it is the support he has right. right, with his teammates. And also, he's a great role model for a lot of these mm -hmm. kids because there are no excuses. You can't give me an excuse, no. right? <laughs> he can do it all because he's just passionate about it. Yeah, I, that's I my favorite that. part, the support from his team. Mm -hmm. That's so important. It's a team. It really is a team, and they're, they're proving that. That's great. I like that. Thank he's you. It was our Friday Good Story, right? Mm -hmm.